A320 Mentor Channel Uncommanded Climb Near the Top of Descent Description When the inserted tropopause altitude is equal to the final FMS cruise flight level, the FMS can erroneously compute a very steep segment in the FMS vertical profile. A guidance anomaly can then order a pitch up to capture this steep segment while in descent mode. In this case, an unexpected climb may occur when the following conditions are satisfied. Tropopause altitude is equal to final FMS cruise flight level. Tropopause altitude can be manually entered on MCDU init a page or received via an AOC uplink. Descent mode is engaged before the top of descent. If this unexpected climb occurs, the aircraft pitches up and auto thrust commands a thrust increase, but speed may decrease. Operational recommendation. How to avoid unexpected climb at top of descent. The tropopause altitude entered or uplinked on MCDU in a day page must be different from the final FMS cruise flight level by at least 10 feet. The altitude of the final FMS cruise flight level is the flight plan altitude at the top of descent. As the flight level may be selected on MCDU or FCU, with an accuracy of 100 feet, tropopause altitude must be set to a value that is not a multiple of 100 feet. For example, if the tropopause altitude is 37,000 feet, then the value 37,010 feet or 36,990 feet must be entered or uplinked on MCDU in it a page. How to manage an unexpected climb near the top of descent. If the aircraft unexpectedly climbs near the top of descent, the flight crew must disengage the descent mode or disconnect the autopilot flight director. Descent mode can then be re-engaged once the top of descent is sequenced and the aircraft is back on the FMS descent profile. A320 Mentor Channel